asking if I, uh, is anything wrong? I'm Margaret's mother. Oh, hello. Come in, Mr. Cope. Thank you. Margaret went to bed with a fever last night, and I came from the valley to give her a hand. I'm sorry to hear that. You say you're neighbors, are you? Yes, we live down the street. Patrick goes to school with my son. Oh, how nice. Is this your day off, Mr. Cope? No, I'm an architect. I work at home mostly. How oh, very convenient. Who is it, Mother? Oh, it's Mr. Cole, dear. Uh, why don't you go on in? I'm just fixing some coffee. Would you like a cup? Oh, sorry. It's me, Kimmy. Um, today is whoa, whoa, wow. Mm, they almost got hit. Car just did not pay attention to where they were going at all. We're at the gas station. Anyway, hey guys, it is. I believe it's Thursday. Um, the days have been going by pretty fast. Yeah. Anyway, um, me and the hubby are getting some gas at the gas pump. And it's such a nice day. So pretty. I'm glad I am, um, I don't know. Yeah, hubby was saying, you want the air on? You can have the air on. I'm like, nope, this feels so good. It feels so nice. Anyway, I think I'll have a cup of coffee later when I get home. And then I'm going to find me a movie. Yesterday I watched a black and white movie. It, it was really good, really old. I think it was made in 1961, I think. Um, so, yeah. There's the hubby looking so handsome. I'm wearing my glamorous earrings today. Anyway, um, yesterday I bought my mom a Mother's Day gift. I'm probably going to go back out today and get something else for myself uh, because I didn't find it yesterday when I was out shopping. Uh, we only went to one store in particular and I wanted to see, I wanted to get my mom um, this fragrance that she mentioned. So yeah that's what I ended up doing and today me Keno and probably Jasmine I think I don't know if Jordan wants to come but we're gonna go out and do a little bit of shopping not a lot I wish we could do a lot but no just want to pick up a couple of um, things I think I want to get some dried floral greenery I sure can, my love. Okay. Uh -huh. <laughs> that is looking good. Looking good. Carl was thirsty, boy. It was, huh? Dang. Yes, it was. 
Yep, our oldest has a job. She's been driving. And she is starting work in what, two weeks? Or a week? Two weeks? Mm -hmm. Is she? Because well, next week she say? Oh, she's. Uh... Again, Jazzy, I had to bring. I had to bring. We are at her school. Uh, what is this? CSU. Yeah, the bookstore. That's what we are. We're at um, her bookstore. Well, she's going to her bookstore. Where is the bookstore? It's, is this uh, it? Or is it it's inside of there? It's inside of the... It's inside Davidson. Oh, okay. Yep, she's got to return a book that you said you didn't use. Yep, well, wasted $60 because my professor was like, yeah, you need this book wow. for public speaking. So you, I you wasted spent... $60 for nothing. Wow. Didn't even touch this Are you going to be able to get your money back? No, because I rented it. So I just wasted what? $60. That is awful. Yeah. Ooh. Don't you just So I'm just going to wait, like, when I do buy my textbooks, I'm just going to wait until, like, the first week of classes. Yeah. Because I don't want to For them to tell you what you need. Money. Yeah, that yeah. makes sense. Yeah. Hi. Jordan's at home. She's got some work to do, so she didn't want to come out with us. There's our jazzy bunny. The college student. My baby. Are you going to be going to this college too, possibly? I don't know. You don't know which college you want to go to? No. Not yet. You don't know yet? No. Pretty self. Yep, yeah, hopefully Jordy will decide to go here. So all my girls will be here. And then they can go wherever they want to go out of two years. Do the first two years here, possibly. Mm-hmm. My little princess. Actually, she's going to stay with us for a long time. Even when you're 20s, you're going to stay with us. So. You're just gonna stay in the house and stay with us. You're not gonna move out. We're just gonna keep you. Damn, I, I literally is probably gonna stay in the house for seven more years. <laughs> she got it planned out. You're gonna be running out of the house. Well, when I'm eight, well, I'm gonna be 18 in seven years, so. <laughs> you wanna move I'm out by the time you're 18? I'm gonna stay here for the like, rest of my life. If I didn't wanna live there, I could just, Joe said I could stay with her anytime I wanted to. Yeah. And you and Jordan gonna get your own place together? Yeah. Yep. Okay. <laughs> you don't want to stay with your mom and dad. No. Not you could be my baby my for for a long time. What you get to be my baby. I'm gonna be missing having a baby again. Well, you get a dog. Get a dog. A yeah, dog is not a... the same. Yeah, as a child. it is. You can cuddle it anytime you want to. Aww. You can play with it. You can feed it. It will go to yeah. sleep on your lap. It's literally just like a baby. <laughs> okay, kid. <laughs> You have to take it out for walks. Mm -hmm. You gotta take it out for walks. That's about mm -hmm. it. And to eat it. Yeah. Give it snacks. Mm -hmm. I want a puppy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I am so sleepy, you guys. Very sleepy. I'm hungry. Dad said I can mm -hmm. trade out. Uh, I'm gonna give him two of my hot dogs because they taste nasty. And then he's gonna let me have one of his. We sausages. went to Walmart and bought some uh, veggie uh, wieners, veggie dogs, There's a smart and we bought sausages, uh, plant-based food. You don't like them? No, I don't It's like a them. new kind. No, well, it's not new, have, but they've had them before, no, but we, don't, we don't normally buy those kind of hot dogs. We don't normally buy them, but for some reason our Walmart is starting to carry they them, They just I guess. taste nasty. Like, the texture is disgusting. It's hard. It tastes like real... Is the, is the My, texture Dad like and, real uh, meat? Dad and Joe like it, but it tastes hard. Probably, they smell just like actual wieners. Yeah, I know they do. They smell like pepperoni. It's like Whoa. They taste nasty. Yeah. Anyway, we're going to... Probably going to Burlington's. I don't know. Yeah, I want to go to I'm so house. addicted to buying fragrances that I can't wait to go to see what they have. I just don't like um, Burlington. Either I like to get my fragrances from uh, discount stores. Now, if I had more money than where I could splurge, then I would go to like uh, the department stores or I would go to Ulta Why don't and we just go, go in there the and mall? see. But they I don't like going fragrances. to the mall. I I am not, girl, your mama. Like, I grew up in the mall. Like, I worked in a mall most of my life. And now that I'm older, I do not care for shopping in malls i am so past that you literally only have one mall here mm -hmm. and um i'm a thrifter i like thrifting i really enjoy that 
and then I like shopping in discount stores and that's about it I shop in discount stores for the home decor stuff and for my clothing I shop at uh, thrifting and that's where I get the bulk I get most of my uh, clothes from thrifting and unless I'm look for something in particular you know for a special occasion maybe I'll shop somewhere else but I used to shop and spend money on my clothes and I just finally started learning how to thrift not just I've been thrifting now for what probably about 10 12 years and I know how to do it and I know where to go and I know how to make my money work for me so it doesn't make sense spending you know hundreds of dollars the way I used to go and buy you know like if I wanted a nice dress really really nice dress I would spend really good money and shop Mommy, at the boutiques show them me. but the girls were much smaller can't splurge like that anymore now alrighty we are back at the house you guys and I wanted to turn on the camera um, because we were in TJ Maxx and I ended up getting two fragrances uh, for my mom and I got one uh, well, actually I got two fragrances one for me one for my mom and I got her one yesterday so she's got two fragrances and all but for right now let me show you what what I ended up getting I got this um, eau de toilette no eau de parfum eau de parfum eau de parfum <laughs> eternity moments um, I've been looking at this one there's a couple of different Eternity scents uh, by Calvin Klein that I wanted to try. But I got this one in the pink. And then I saw this. I just fell in love with this face. This beautiful, beautiful gold face. Um, I think it's the Buddha. The Buddha. Hand Corp something. Anyway, yeah. I got it. And um, I'm not sure where I'm going to put it. But it is so pretty. And I just figured it will look really, really nice over here. So, I think I'm going to put it right there. Isn't that pretty? Yeah. So, anyway. Um, I ended up moving all of my fragrances over here. This is where they are for now. Hold on. And I want to have, like, three tiers. Um, so, that is my goal. My goal is by next year to have this whole area filled and then I want to do one here but either way um, I want to have a lot more I want at least 10 more bottles of fragrances by the end of the year so 10 more bottles <laughs> I'm addicted you guys I've never been this addicted and I used to work in fragrances and I was never into fragrances like this but I guess it's something about being an older woman you just you know have new interest and things so anyway we're gonna try this scent out see what it smells like I still one that I still want to get is uh, by Bulgari and I didn't see it this time around but um, if I, they didn't have it at this particular TJ Maxx, they might have it at the other one or Marshall's. Okay, here we go. Okay, this is what it looks like. Pink, blushy pink color. It's nice okay we're gonna give it like give it a few you know so it can dry down and then I think it will smell really really nice let's see I don't I wouldn't know how to describe this scent but it's very nice hmm. Let's try to attempt to, to, to describe it. I want to say 
a hint of sweetness, powdery. It has like some kind of blossom, some kind of white, I want to say white blossom. <laughs> a hint of pink pepper. It is kind of warm. It is a, it, it's like a light scent, but it's more on a mature side. I don't know if uh, if uh, younger people would really enjoy this, but it's more like a, a hint of vanilla, just a hint. Okay, that's all I can say, but it's very nice. Okay. All right, so this is, I'll be adding the Eternity Moments into my collection. And like I said, it's very nice. I see myself wearing this more so like, um, you know, if I wanted to dress up or something like that, it definitely feels like a more of a scent that you wear, you know, if you're like dressed out for dinner, something like that. But it's not, I mean, you could wear it every day, but it doesn't smell like one of those everyday scents that's, it's kind of, it kind of gives you more like a, a, a dimensions of like spring, summer, and it will carry you in through uh, to the fall because it has a warmth to it. Kind of like just a subtle heaviness to it, you know? But I like it. All right, so it's not bad. So uh, there we go to add to my collection. And I love my little Buddha. I think this is the Buddha. I want to call it the Buddha, but I'm going to look into it. But it's really, really nice. So. I will see you guys.